Hi, I'm Ryan Wright. Today, I'm gonna to be covering movie news that I found interesting for the second week of June 2015. The official plot for Batman vs Superman has been released. It confirms that Batman and Superman will be versing each other, but that a new threat arises putting mankind in all kinds of danger. The threat, Batman and Superman contemplating homosexuality. John Bernthal will play the Punisher in the upcoming season of Daredevil. The Punisher is a vigilante who gets the job done no matter how lethal it is, which includes coming on your girlfriend's face. Asa Butterfield is reportedly out of the running for Spider-Man because like an idiot, he talked about it before getting authorization from the gods of Marvel. Chris Hemsworth signs on for a role in the Ghostbusters reboot as the male receptionist. Meanwhile, his brother, Liam Hemsworth, will be starring in a movie that no one cares about. It's been revealed that the Power Rangers movie will have its villain be Rita Repulsa. Looking at this photo of Rita Repulsa, you can say that she is also Vagina Repulsa. Netflix acquires original film War Machine starring Brad Pitt. First we had Terrence Howard, then Don Cheadle, now Brad Pitt. <laughs> I'm kidding, it's not it's not that war machine character. James Cameron is supportive of Terminator Genesis and says that it is the real third film. Internet folks have been seeing that Cameron was probably paid to say those words. Yes, the man who has co-written, produced, and directed the two biggest box office hits of all time needed the extra cash. Chiwetel Ejiofor, the guy from 12 Years a Slave, is Baron Mordo in Marvel's Doctor Strange. I don't know much about the character other than the fact that he's... black. The director of The Grey, Joe Carnahan, may be directing Bad Boys 3. Bad Boys 3 is a necessary film because Martin Lawrence is... who is he again? That's right, that's my point. No one fucking remembers. Pitch Perfect 3 is on its way. Yeah, of course it is. Alright guys, well that's it for my movie news of the week. You can tune in next week for more movie news. You can follow The Real Rejects on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and Vine. And you can check out my videos on latinoreview.com. And despite what you white people might think, it is not run by gangsters.